Hey, we're going to be looking at a 1984 menu number seven turkey dice with gravy with accessory packet A made by Southern Packing Company, Packing and Storage. Uh, this is made in Mullins, South Carolina. So, uh, this has actually been, already been opened because the vi original video footage was lost. So, uh, we're just going to go ahead and pull the things out and see what we have in it. Um, we have our crackers, we have our cocoa beverage powder, a potato patty dehydrated, apple jelly, we have a maple nut cake with a date of uh, the 345th day of 1984, we have our Turkey diced with gravy, which was the 355th day of 1984. And we have our accessory packet, which is coffee, cream substitute, sugar, salt, chewing gum, matches, and toilet paper. And then, of course, our old style MCI white spoon. So, I'm going to have to open these up and get them out. And we're going to go ahead and heat the uh, turkey up and get some water ready for the uh, cocoa beverage powder and the coffee. And we'll be right back. Okay, while our turkey's heating, we're going to go ahead and open up the rest. Let's check out our uh, potato patty. These are freeze-dried, and they pretty much last quite a while. We're not going to try to rehydrate it. Actually looks to be in really good condition. It's just a normal potato patty like you'd get at McDonald's, just freeze dried. Next, let's check out our crackers. They seem to have a pretty good seal still on them. Okay, these have actually been broken in half, but these are like the old style actually had salt on them. Uh, let's take get a sniff on these real quick. Uh, not really sure on them, but we'll find out in a minute. Next, we'll check out our maple nut cake. I'd really hope for this to be... Uh, in good condition. It's actually probably my all-time favorite of the nut cakes. It actually doesn't look bad. Still feels kind of moist. I'll go ahead and just take a bite of that and see. This is actually still in perfect condition. The nuts have not gone rancid. And I am definitely going to enjoy going to enjoy this. Let's check out our uh, accessory packet. With our toilet paper, salt, uh, book of matches, and white tips, our sugar. Creamer still feels good. And our coffee type type one. Let's check to see if it's gotten any mold on it. And uh, no, it still looks good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our cocoa powder and we're gonna go ahead and make a Steve 1989 mocha out of this. And of course, that's still in excellent shape. Take our cocoa and our coffee. Of course, our creamer. And 
our sugar. Go ahead and add our water. Let's give that a good stir. And this was before they actually started putting the sports drinks in the MREs or the heaters. So you didn't get any of the uh, fruit drinks. So let's go get our main course and we'll be right back. Okay, we're back with our turkey. It's all heated up. And I forgot to mention, I got this from uh, another YouTube member. His name was um, Elandel. Uh, he knew that this was my very first MRE that I'd ever tried back in the 80s. And he searched one out and found it for me. So I was really thankful for him to him for this. Uh, here's our turkey and gravy. It looks to be in really good condition. Um, let's go ahead and taste the gravy first and see how well that's held up. Uh, really not much flavor on it. Uh, let's try a little piece of the meat and see if that's held up. Yeah, it's just little cubes of turkey. I'd have to say that there's not much flavor to it. Uh, no bad aftertaste. Um, it seems to be in pretty good condition. It's been kept in pretty good condition. Um, these are just... You know, nice actual chunks of turkey. Let's give it another taste. Yeah, not bad. Let's go ahead and try the crackers. And I really would have loved if they'd have stayed with these type of cracker that was salted. They taste perfectly fine, just like a, a saltine should. Let's check out our apple jelly on the crackers. Looks a little dark, but that should be expected, I suppose, for 33 years. Um, And again, that one's that's held up perfectly well. Let's try our potato patty. That is absolutely perfectly uh, held up. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Um, so we'll just try to dip it in the gravy a little bit to maybe soften it. Yeah, that's absolutely just fantastic. Those were always good. Um, never any problems with them. Let's try our Steve 1989 Mochaccino. Oh, perfect as always. And now I've got to get another bite of the uh, maple nut cake because this... It's very rare that you can find one that's actually still intact. Yeah, overall I'd have to say this is probably one of my favorite meals of all time. Mostly because it was the very first one I ever tried when I enlisted. And they've never made another one like it since. So... Hope you all enjoyed this uh, look at this uh, vintage MRE. 
And uh, we forgot our gum, but I'll save that for after. It's the spearmint, obviously. And I'll be saving that for after I finish this because this is going to be finished. Thank you for watching.